You probably have heard the story about Chief Justice Warren not wanting to serve on this commission. He turned down the offer of chairmanship when he was approached by the then uh, Deputy Attorney General Nick Katzenbach and the Solicitor General Professor Archibald Cox of Harvard. He turned it down because he felt that the past history of the Supreme Court showed that using justices on non-judicial assignments was a divisive and unproductive use of their time and, and adverse to the interests of the court. However, President Johnson, using his legendary forces of persuasion, called the Chief Justice into his office, made reference to the Chief Justice's service in World War I, and said, what you did then is only a precursor of what you could do now in the service of your country. And the Chief Justice, being that sort of archaic figure in American history, said, yes, Mr. President, I will do my best. President, you may not know also that there was another resistant uh, uh, person to the, during the commission, and that was Senator Richard Russell of Georgia. It was very important to President Johnson to have representation from Congress, not because they were going to attend all the hearings and have a, 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 a attendance record of credit, but because they would bring to the task the judgment, experience, and political uh, wisdom that would help produce a report that would be accepted by the American people and indeed of the world. Senator Russell, however, was adamant. He did not like Chief Justice Warren. He did not like the liberal rulings of the Supreme Court. He did not like anything about this commission. And he sat there explaining at some length to the president why he could not serve on this commission. And President Johnson reasoned with him appealed to their long relationship, appealed to his sense of loyalty to the presidency, and got absolutely nowhere. And at the president closed this conversation by telling Senator Russell, I'm sorry, Senator, I've already announced to the press that you're a member. <laughs> um, so at, at that point, the senator had no choice, and he did uh, work with uh, a Chief Justice Warren, but Let's put it this way, as infrequently as possible. Yeah.